Hi, my name is Neil Rogers. I'm a senior semantic consultant with ITS Partners. We're an engineer-centric consultant organization. We focus on semantic endpoint management software and workflow solution. And our goal is to increase employee knowledge and deliver business benefits to our customers. Let's get started. What I want to talk about today is Windows 7 imaging versus Windows 7 scripting. I'm starting to prefer a script OS install because it seems to go faster. What happens in your process as you're deploying your first sets of machines especially is that you're delivering these machines with an image, it takes all those files down the machine and then runs the unattended setup. We have the same process with the scripted except it delivers the files down um, as a group and then runs through the same unattended process. The unattended process takes longer than delivering the files in the first place so all you're getting by having the software in there is that it will not have to be delivered afterwards and that's something that we've always talked about with hardware independent imaging, we try and limit as much of that out as possible. So the next part of the process is the drivers themselves. And of course this is where the big gotcha was before because we didn't have the network card so in the unattended it couldn't actually join the domain in the first place. Well, the solution for that is Windows 7 has almost every single network card built into the OS so we have not really run into a problem yet with the network drivers that are built in. And then the other drivers, most other drivers nowadays don't have their files inside the system. Um, they have, you can't just put an INF on there and have it bring the other files it needs in there. What happens is it has to run a software application to install the control panel software it needs so you can change your settings, you can change your video, you can change your audio. So because of that, you don't have the advantages you used to have when running sysprep. That actually creates a problem if you try to install the drivers without the control panel software and it just doesn't work. So what I'm trying to recommend is that they, as customers go through this process, that they work on using a script OS to start and if they get right, when they're ready for their mass migrations of, you know, 100 at a time, 200 at a time in a night, well in that case imaging makes more sense. So not perfect in every solution, but this is one advantage it gives you to start that process a little lot quicker and to get things going for your environment better. If you want more information on this, feel free to contact me. Have a good day.